Again, uh, uh, nothing heard on the SDRs, and matter of fact, I have my Arlington SDRs bit the dust. I'm not sure why that is, but it, it uh, probably, uh, you know, a lot of these SDRs are timed, and uh, if you don't have the uh, password, uh, you've got to do a reset, and that uh, Arlington SDR is a PC in my bedroom. <laughs> so, uh, uh, so much for that. But what I've tried to do is uh, create a grid across the uh, southeast uh, uh, United States uh, from uh, uh, Rochester to uh, Raleigh and uh, then uh, Arlington and uh, Milford, PA, kind of the southeast uh, USA. And um, so, uh, you know, uh, we're trying to augment our local antenna, which is around Louisville, Kentucky. And uh, if we can uh, help uh, get those 100 waters in a little bit better, uh, that's what we're trying to do. Uh, this is KC9 VKV. Trying to do. Uh, this is KC9 VKV. Y H P. Come back with the call sign again, please, slowly, phonetically. Yeah, November 8, Yankee Hotel, Papa. The name's David. I'm in uh, West Virginia. Roger, David. Uh, what radio are you running, sir? I'm running the uh, ICOM 746 Pro and a uh, Silver Eagle D104. Wow, that's the best D104 I've ever heard. Usually, now that must have uh, the preamp built in on that uh, D104, Roger. Uh, Roger on that. It has the FET uh, preamp built in. Yeah, absolutely, because uh, that microphone uh, without that preamp is is pretty much sheet tin uh, because it's such a high impedance uh, uh, transducer that it really needs that uh, FET uh, preamp uh, high impedance for, to match, Roger. Roger, uh, I think your name is Jim. I've been listening here for a while, and uh, you have uh, very good audio here. I'm running uh, just the... Uh, Zero on my equalizer there, and uh, just D104 straight into the radio. So that's the station here. The wave, uh, um, horizontal half wave at 50 feet. So that's the antenna here. Uh, thank you, Jim. Roger, David. Well, that uh, microphone uh, d usually does have uh, some um, artifacts. Um, it does have some uh, upper end artifacts that are more, per more pronounced when there is that mismatch uh, between uh, the uh, high impedance uh, diaphragm and the... Um, uh, <laughs> I'm getting strange messages on my, um, my SDRs. Hmm. Not sure exactly what's going on there. Anyway, um, but uh, your your situation there is just absolutely perfect. That's just the, the the best possible connection that you could make on that audio situation. Okay, uh, Jim. Yeah, I uh, turned the amp on here. Running an 811H uh, amp with four uh, 572Bs here. So uh, thanks for coming by back to me there, and uh, thanks for the good audio report. I have had other very good reports on that, so I thought I'd let you hear it here. So have a good one, Jim. I'll go ahead and say 73. Have a good weekend there. KC9 VKV uh, N8YHP. Now, David, don't keep those surprises in the closet. you got to start with those, you know. <laughs> I heard that, yeah. <laughs> Great sound. Great sound. Have a good day, man. You'd be proud of that station. This is KC9 VKV in the Acuso uh, Vlog network, and uh, we're uh, recording now until 5 uh, live. And if you've got a radio you want to check out, uh, uh, give us a shout. KC9 VKV.